So I've just had an Iceland food delivery. Again, not much freezer stuff, just a few items. Um, so the first one is I've got the steak cut chips because I've been using a lot of fresh potatoes. But again, I need to go to Lidl to get a sack. I've got the crispy potatoes, they were a pound. And like I keep saying, I tend to do those um, sometimes on their own, like that in the oven or in the air fryer. But sometimes, you know, um, some form of sauce um, near the end of the cooking and then some grated cheese and sometimes even I've added things like little bits of sausage, bacon and things like that. Um, peas a pound because we've had peas quite a few times this last week with different meals. I think this might have been £4.50. It used to be £4. I keep saying this, most items, I don't think it's just Iceland, have gone up 25 50 pence, mostly 50 pence. I used to get this for £4. I'm sure it's £4.50. This is the classic minced beef and dumpling um, tray bake. Serves four, but it's only for two. I tend to get some partly baked bread to go with it. That is for the caravan. As one of the meals for our son, I've got pizzas in, um, so you can have a pizza night. He's working all weekend. It's the cheese um, feast crust and the um, double pepperoni, which is also cheese crust. And I'm sure they are, that one says two, but I'm sure they're two, both two pounds each. Um, these and this are repeat buys. This one isn't. So these are all like three pounds each. So we've got the barbecued strips, something getting quick meals in that our son can quickly um, cook in the oven and then the sun fried um, shredded chicken haven't had this um, previously um, so we'll try that out and the sun fried eight um, breast steaks now the reason I've done this these two I say are normal because I love them something that I've got two of these because I haven't been able to get these. They are frozen. This is the chicken gravy, southern fried. I'm um, hopefully they might. It might be similar to the gravy you actually get from KFC because I thought with um sort of chips or wedges that I've got in the oven. Um, excuse me, in the freezer can have like a southern fried um meal um rather than takeaway. And then I've got just the um six mint chop chip cones and they're still a pound. But you'll probably realise, um, if I didn't mention, I'm not sure if I mentioned about these, um, thinking about it. These are the quarter pounds we always have. They have been £2.50 for so long, but they are now £2.75 a box. Um, something else that has actually increased. I find that a lot of it is sort of meat products and things. And I'm not sure if these sort of things are not going up as yet because of um, the packaging. I, I, I'm not sure if that is the correct, whether these will eventually go up. But at the moment, um, they're still the same price and have been for a while. And again, I don't know whether they can't do that because of the price on the packaging. Anyway, so I'm going to get this away. Then I do the next section of my food. I usually make a declaration if I get prices wrong, but as I said, most things, you're going to hear this over and over again, um, prices have increased. Instead of buying, um, they are £3.50, but you can get two lots for £6. So I've split it this time, so I've had 22 packets of the classic ones, but I've also then had 22 packets of the watt sets because they're both walkers so it was two lots for six pounds and for bread products i've got these rolls um pack of eight love these um they were a pound and they're still very nice when they come out of the freezer once it's been frozen um son's requested some wraps so we can do some chicken wraps um, while we're away and the loaf I think was 97 pence we've gone on to that do like that and don't mind it because um, that's Iceland's own brand don't mind it once it's um, defrosted out of the freezer um, we've got potatoes were two pounds and the onions were a pound I think the milk might have been 139 this has gone up. This is now one twenty-five instead of a pound. The cheese has gone up. Um, instead of five pound, it's five pound fifty now for the two slabs. 
um the testers were a pound a packet and you get two in a packet so we like those we may be taking those to the caravan um for the weekend the slices were still a pound they have like it shares shows there with the burgers got the bolognese sauce a fraction of the price got it from i'm sure it was Lidl. i need to have a look back um because we quite like their bolognese sauce yeah, so I want to get some, I'm sure it's from Lidl, um, of the bolognese sauce. Um, this one, too bad, I think they were a pound each, but I know it was a fraction of the price from Lidl. I'm sure it was Lidl. I think these were three pounds um, for 16, and Hubby gets through a lot of these because he takes these to work, and these are three in one. Brilliant if you're on the road as well, if you've got a flask, because sometimes what I do when we've been travelling especially in the past, not so much the last couple of years, is I take um, a flask of hot water, but then I take something like this and I will have a separate container with tea bags in and sometimes I take the milk separate as well. But very often when we're on the road, hubby does prefer coffee, although he's a tea drinker. This is something else that's gone up. I haven't had this in such a long time. This is the broken um, biscuit assortment. Um, these used to be three pounds. These are now three pounds fifty, and then it's um, four packets of biscuits. They're fifty five pence each, but four for two pounds. And as you can see, this is the best of value because you get three hundred grams against two hundred, but they're all the same price. So the shortest now that is really good offer even for 55 pence coconut rings we haven't had for ages although hubby doesn't like coconut but my, me and my son do and then the nice biscuits and again as you can see 200 grams against 300 probably not such a good value eggs i believe was a pound and the turkey ham was a pound for our son's packing up um i did get some pepsi max i've got um four more bottles in the hall um, this used to be two for three pounds fifty. It's now two for four pounds. So that's those. Um, got these mini rolls in a pound. Especially our son likes these, and so does our granddaughter. And then a few extra little bits. A um, couple for Easter. A few for um, our son. So we've got these milk and um, chocolate raisins. They were a pound. The bars of chocolate are still, I believe, 85 pence. Both um, the guys like these, the drumstick chocolate make. And as you know, hubby loves anything drumstick. He also likes dime. So I've got in these um, ready for Easter. These are the Cabrit milk dime. Although, I don't know about anybody else, but I do moan about taking the wrappers off and everything. But there you are. It's... It saves, doesn't it, a little bit, you know, to slow down and not eat too much chocolate at once. So that's the dime ones. And then I've got the Smarty Mini Eggs to um, put in our granddaughter's Easter basket. As I said, I'm splitting the cost like I do over Christmas or leading up to Christmas, do things like that. But also, these are normally 60 pence each, but two for a pound, so you save a bit. But I like these. And these are the Orange Moose Bunnies bit of orange and everything but what i like about it look it's got the peter rabbit um wrapper and i got a mug last year actually i don't know whether it was after easter for this year and she does use actually a little mug now with that lid pottery mug so i've already got that so i know there's products in like poundland and round that i got the peter rabbit um sort of thing as you know colour schemes themes and things like that and things that I know people like I like to bunch together so I thought I'd purchase those I might even take the um, mug out the box in and put you know things like this in I must look in Poundland I know they had the mini eggs um, Peter Rabbit and see if there's anything else about if anybody else has seen any Peter Rabbit products please let me know I might still even get her a book although I have got to check so i know i've got activity books already for her so that's the last of this um shopping might not seem so much i don't know what people think for three adults but we will be um doing a bit of food shop probably over the weekend and getting bits and pieces in plus although i can't pick up freezer stuff because we've been in the caravan um we do want to go to the 
Iceland Food Warehouse at Corby. We're also hopefully then going on to Lincolnshire sometime over the weekend, as long as everybody is well enough because um, Hubby's father's had a lot of medical problems over the last few years. Um, we're hoping to um, go on and um, meet up with him um, due to the fact that we've seen a lot of my family um, over the last two days as I've commented because for two days I hardly did anything but the basics because we went visiting, meeting up, we went out for a meal with some um, family members, others we um, visited different homes. So hopefully you've enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.